It is late afternoon. Have you not vlogged yet? And I'm just starting to vlog. My phone's ringing. Um, the house is in shambles. I've been working all day um, on packing. Um, still in my pajamas. Haven't fixed my hair or done any kind of makeup. And um, we're just kind of working away and trying to get this house packed up. On top of that, I have to prepare for a yard sale tomorrow, which is really the last thing that I feel like doing. But when I look in the garage, it's just overwhelming. It has to happen because it's completely full. But I really don't want to do it. Um, so yeah, I am packing away. Also, this um, morning I was busy listing some things to sell on Craigslist. I was busy um, emailing the landlord our applications with all of our information and everything and um, just lots of kind of busy work that I've had to do today and so I have a feeling like I said yesterday that there's going to be quite a few of these days where I'm just not doing a lot of vlogging. Um, but I will show you what shambles of a mess the house is in. So, kitchen. I'm stacking up boxes over here. Hey, Gavin. Gavin's here. Hey, Gavin. Hi. Hey, Gavin. We miss Gavin. And packing here, packing there. All of those are empty. This is, for the most part, empty. I have left out my tutor supplies, things that I need for CC. I'm working on emptying those putting those in there. I think I'm going to sell this whiteboard because it's not a really good whiteboard and doesn't erase very well. Most of that has been packed away. The big one on the wall. Um, here's the schoolroom. So lots of boxes. All of those are empty. I'm going to take that off the wall. Here's my empty bookshelf here. This is also empty. I'm going to sell the desk. So that has to go to the garage. Um, and then I will show you, um, I have all of this done. I don't know if I showed you this yesterday, but more boxes in here. And it's just kind of crazy. It is kind of crazy. And Gavin's going to help me with the yard sale tomorrow. Oh, wait, wait, wait. Wait, you have yard sale tomorrow? Uh-huh. Okay, and you're going to help me carry some stuff out to the garage to oh, sell. Oh, oh, then I'm going to That means we have to get like six? Yeah. I guess what, Mom? I don't want to get out of Sorry, what? go to bed early. Mom, what? I'm going to bed early too. You're going to go to bed early too? Yeah, yeah we got a lot of work to do. So, I know you guys do not envy me, envy me in the slightest <laughs> with all this crazy work that has to be done. Ugh. I don't envy myself at all. And I keep coming across stuff that I'm thinking I should just get rid of, I should just get rid of, I should just get rid of, but then I'm worried that if I get rid of it, um, I'm gonna need it right away. Oh my goodness, what do you have? No, ma'am. Where did you get this? Paint. She has paint. Oh, no, 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 no. That's daddy's paint. Nope, can't do that. She was getting paint out of this bucket right here. Oh, show everybody. Let me see your face, Madeline. Yeah, look at you. Come on. This is. Maddie has, and Mason have been doing some watercolor paint and Maddie decided to paint her face, didn't you? Watercolor? We just finished a project in art. Really? Yeah. Well, there's some watercolor there if you want to do some art, Gavin. Want to do some art? Nope. <laughs> we have to do this thing now. We have to draw like an elephant. Oh. And we have to do these d designs. It's, no. That sounds good. We haven't even started it yet. We just finished up. Oh, are you going to break your necklace like that, sweetie? Where's it at? Oh. Here. Step out of it. Look, you stretched it out. So Miss Maddie Bear just woke up, guys, and it is like eight o'clock. She had a nice long nap, and um, we are both still in our jammies. Let me turn the light on. So we've had a jammy day, lots of work going on. And now, um, Daddy and the boys, are out putting out the yard sale signs and they are picking up some takeout dinner which is just how it's gonna be 
and I can't do anything about that. Um, so, Miss Maddie's having some yogurt. You're having some yogurt? Mm -hmm. Is it delicious? Mm -hmm. It is. It's strawberry? Mm -hmm. Yeah. She's having strawberry yogurt. Mm -hmm. And we are getting ready to have a nice bath, right? We're gonna have a nice bath because mommy feels yucky. <laughs> and I still have a good bit of work to do tonight to get ready for the yard sale. But I just feel just kind of gross. I really need to like wash my hair and feel a little refreshed. McDonald's, give me fun to eat. Yeah, go to McDonald's. I just got that on too. Go. You won't let me. Yeah, go. Why won't you let me go to McDonald's? It's yard sale day. Where'd I put my coffee? It's cold. Okay. It's okay. And. <laughs> Maddie. Maddie. Buddy, mm -hmm. come here. Let me see you, Doc McStuffins. Oh, hey, Doc McStuffins. Doc you look beautiful. Charlie Horse. It's Doc McPunnies. <laughs> oh, you're going to get it, huh? You look beautiful. Maddie's got her gloves on. We just had to bust out some gloves from the box. I have my gloves on. These are the ones I crocheted last year. Let me show you guys. So here they are. I'll probably be making some more of these this year because they're so awesome. And they are fabulous for keeping your hands warm and having your fingers free. Is it freezing today? Yes. I, I wish I still had my ninja mask on. All right, guys, so I'm going to show you. Actually, I think I'll hop up. Don't get in my seat. I'm going to show you guys our yard sale today, and it's actually kind of sad how much stuff we have. Yeah. It's kind of sad how much stuff we have out here, so I am praying, praying, praying for some traffic today. We've already made about $100, which is good, but I hope that we get rid of a lot, so let me show you what our yard sale looks like. All right, so let me start from here going all the way over so that's what it looks like we've got lots and lots of stuff and toys hey I've been really careful not to show the front of my house too much in my vlogs but since we're moving um, I think I really don't care anymore so <laughs> there's the front of the house yeah there's a chair. Okay. Mm-hmm. Okay. <laughs> stuff and stuff and stuff. Do your hands feel better now? Uh-huh. Her little hands were like so red and so freezing that I had to go track down some gloves because I was like worried that she was going to have frostbite or something. So if I do not sell this stuff today probably going to put it online for like insanely cheap and then whatever doesn't sell after that will be going to goodwill so that is the plan because i am not going to hold on to it and move it for sure hey mason i'm rich oh how much money did you make today like a whole one dollar whole one daddy cent? he's got like fifteen dollars so far fifteen dollars but no persons are coming here no persons First we don't have any traffic right now, but we've made some good progress. So, we have done okay. It hasn't been great. We haven't had, like, super busy traffic today. Um, we've made some money, though, which is good, and it's definitely been worth our time. So, we're going to hang out for another couple hours, probably. Oh, I need to know Hour, hour and a half, and then we will probably be loading up for the Goodwill. All right, guys, so the yard sale is over. We did okay. Um, we got everything cleaned up, and we have an entire trailer full of yard sale stuff to take to Goodwill. So we're going to go and drop that stuff off at Goodwill. We're going to grab some lunch somewhere, probably our favorite stop, which is Sauceritas. And um, finally, yeah, my camera is acting up. So I'm having a really hard time getting it to even turn on and focus. So I hope I'm in focus right now, but I have no idea. Um, so, you know, when, it, when I need money for other things, something always happens. So that's great. But anyway, hopefully it will work today. 
Um, so, we are getting ready to leave. We are also going to go to the um, probably Home Depot or somewhere like that Lowe's and get um, a leaf blower because we're going to need a leaf blower over at the new house. So I think we're going to do that. We may even go over and do a little bit of work outside. Hey guys, good morning. So I am upstairs right now and I'm just starting to empty out all the toy bins and sort through the toys and decide what is coming and what is going. We already got rid of a lot of toys yesterday. We donated an entire um, trailer full of stuff to Goodwill, which felt really, really nice to get rid of all that stuff. So it is a total mess up here. And that just goes with the territory of packing and moving. So let me just show you what I've got on my hands today. Um, so I'm up here and I have emptied out all of the containers over here of toys. So I've got a big pile of toys right here. There's another toy bin over here. I have all of the empty bins packed in here. And what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna take this empty box and I'm gonna put the things that I know I'm gonna keep in that box. And then I have another one here and the toys that we don't really need, I'm going to put in here. And what I'll probably also do is have a sort bin for toys that need to be sorted in another place. Um, like things like this. Um, this has lots of pieces to it and I've seen some of the pieces kind of laying around. And so what I'm gonna try to do is organize those toys so that when I'm unpacking, I don't have to do all of that. I can just take it out and put it in its place. So it should be fairly easy. Like I know this is one of her favorite toys, so that will definitely go in here. And then her little purse. I hear her cry. Let me see what has happened. Okay, a little meltdown, a little bit of drama, but that's how it is around here. that kicked the bucket so I managed to get it on and um, I just decided that I would try to you know vlog with it for a little bit because I went to Target picked out you know a cheaper camera to use just to get me by and realized that I had forgotten my debit card and the um, coupon that I was gonna use so I'm on my way back home to get both of those but I may end up um, just saving the receipt because if I can get this one working again I've just been working with it in the car 
um, and it's working okay. So if I can get this one working again, I might just save that money. I'm not sure what I'm gonna do because it's so it's been so like wishy-washy. It's sometimes it's working and sometimes it's not. So I don't really know what I'm gonna do. I really don't want to go spend two hundred dollars on a camera today, but I really need to be vlogging. So. I'm not sure what I'm gonna do. Okay, so seriously, I have just turned this camera off and on like five times and it's working perfectly. So now I'm on my way back to Target, but now I'm wondering if I even should. Dilemma, dilemma, dilemma. I don't even know. So why is it that whenever you're moving, your house goes to shambles? I mean, it is in complete shambles. There is just stuff everywhere you know it looks like you just take your house and turn it upside down and shake it you know is <laughs> what it looks like it is completely craziness so I don't function well in environments like that so my goal today will be to sort of clean up and organize all of the random stuff to get it in some sort of um, like logical arrangement <laughs> some type of something that looks a little bit neater than what it is now and um, yeah get some laundry done too because when I'm, I'm we've been so preoccupied doing everything else that the laundry's kind of piling up so laundry has to get done and um, hopefully I can have everything kind of in some sort of an organized manner by the end of the day and then we'll be over at the new house toward the evening doing lots of um, work over there I kind of don't want to show you guys the house until I get it the way I want it so when I'm over there um, I may not do lots of vlogging because I'd like to not show it until we get moved in so I'm still debating on exactly what I'm going to do as far as that goes because I would like to do more of like a, um, you know, like a house tour video whenever I'm happy with the way, well not, you know, completely happy with the way it looks, but, um, you know, after the work has been done and things like that, so I'm hoping to um, be able to get that sort of done quickly so that I can show you guys more of the other house and, um, how it looks because there really is a lot of work that has to be done. What are you doing? Okay, I'm gonna, I'm gonna do that side. You want a Pepsi? <laughs> Pepsi. Pepsi, I'll get it. You want to get it? Yeah. You can't have Pepsi. I came for a camera and I'm leaving with some sheer window panels. My camera miraculously healed itself. Oh, I you said Hi. And some powder and I some blade plugins. Who's on your shirt? Have you seen who's on your shirt? Look Star. down. Look. Look right here. Hell kitty. Hell kitty. <laughs> All right. So I've been packing like a mad woman. I'm now upstairs in Maddie's room. And I'm getting ready to get the majority of her room decorations packed away. I've got some wrapping paper here. And I'm going to take all the hardware off the walls I've been putting in here because screws are expensive. So I've got a bag full of screws here and our curtain things there. So I'm going to take this stuff down. Hello. And... Get all the screws out of the wall. So there's one there. I've got to take that one out. And now I'm going to wrap all that stuff up and put it in one of the boxes.
she was really giving us a hard time as we're trying to pack everything up. Daddy and Jacob are downstairs loading up his trailer and um, I just got up and I think I'm going to try to work on a little bit of laundry because that has to happen. It's getting back up and nobody wants to move dirty laundry, right? Miss Maddie's awake from her nappy. <laughs> she had a little nappy and daddy and the boys went to take a load of things that were packed up in the trailer to the new house. And so this is what our living room looks like right now. So we have the chair gone and the love seat is gone. And the kitchen is a total mess. Maddie's hungry. Okay, come on. Oh, this Maddie Bear's hungry. So we're gonna come down and see. Oh, I see food. You see food? That's Maxie's food. I'll get it. We don't need to eat Maxie's food. Do you want um? You want some oatmeal? Yeah. Let me make you some oatmeal. Okay. I think I'm gonna make her a little bit of oatmeal tonight. Um, she likes oatmeal and it's fast and it's healthy for her. So I think that's what we're gonna have. She and I actually might both have some oatmeal. So, um, as soon as we get through eating a little bit of oatmeal, we are going to finish a little bit, careful, a little bit of packing um, and some more tidying up around the house because it really is very messy and there's quite a bit of just general housework that needs to be done here's miss mounty bear's oatmeal added some water i'm just gonna stir it up all right guys so take a look at all these coffee mugs now i am in the middle of a coffee mug purge oops my lens is acting up so um I don't need this many coffee mugs and there's a lot of coffee mugs that I haven't used in years in this stash so what I'm going to do is I'm going to pick out just a few coffee mugs that I really enjoy using and then the rest of them are going to go in a donation bin so um, I think this will be fairly easy because I do have my favorite mugs that I enjoy drinking out of um, so I'm going to do the same thing I have all these wine glasses and I don't even drink wine um, I have just loads and loads of cups and things and I'm really not going to have the room to keep all of this and there's no reason for me to keep it. So I'm going to purge it and then I'm going to show you what I end up with, okay? So here is the before. I have lots of mugs here and all these wine glasses. I'm not really sure. I just may keep the wine glasses. I'm not sure my mom gave me this set. And so that has some sentimental value. And, you know, I'm not sure what I'm going to do. I don't think I need that one. So that one's definitely going to go. Um, but I definitely think that I can um, get this down quite a bit. So I will show you guys in just a few minutes. All right, so here is the few that I decided to keep. This one came from my mom. I, I have a, a really hard time giving or purging things that were given as a gift. So that one came from my mom. This one I enjoy drinking out of. I think it was from TJ Maxx or Marshalls. This was given to me as a gift from... Um, okay, good girl. This one was given to me as a gift from Jacob and Gavin when they came back from the Bahamas. Um... I'm kind of on the fence about this one, but sometimes when we have company over, this is a good one for my dad to drink his coffee out of. This one, and then I have this one here, and then my new owl one that I just got. Um, so I feel like that's, that's plenty. I don't really know. I would like to have matching sets, but these all kind of have some type of sentimental value to me. So I'm going to wrap these up and put them in the box. All right, and now for the next purge, guys. We have all these plastic cups and even some bottles and things down in here. Lots of tops. So I've got to clean out this cabinet and get it down to something that is reasonable. I've also got more plastic cups and uh, sippy cups and things in the dishwasher. Oh, don't do that. 
So this is my purge so far. That is what I'm getting rid of, and there is going to be a lot more in there when it's all done. Right, Miss Maddie? Yeah. 